Hi, Gay. Happy Pride Month. We are sashaying away with deals. Is anybody else worried about the cis people? Have, have we checked on them lately? I'm concerned. Everyone's like, oh, people are just gay for attention nowadays. Where's my attention? Where's my attention? Que tú me tienes temblando de noche y de día. Sometimes when I tell people I'm pansexual, they'll be like, oh, what, so you have sex with pans? And I'm like, no, that's, that's actually really ignorant. Uh, the truth is I have sex with most kitchenware. Like, like, don't. Like, what's the gender neutral term if you want to, like, call someone mommy or daddy? Parent. <laughs> yes, parent. Ooh, yeah, guardian. <laughs> One time in bed. I what I wanted I almost said good girl to someone but then I remembered like last minute that they're non-binary so then I just said good 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 like, I almost thought about saying like good person <laughs> Dear the people in charge of book cover design I would like to have a conversation cuz there's a lot of books that look like this yeah and then there's also a lot of books that look like this you know what I'm saying now, regardless of the quality of these books, I take issue with the cover. And I truly thought that you couldn't get a gay book with a good cover. And then I saw this at the library and I was like, that looks gay. Guess what? It is. And it has a good cover too. I know, unheard of. Um, so I just want to let you guys know that you can make good covers for books. Gay news. You will not believe what the Disney Channel just did. I would say all that. <laughs> I'm gonna take you out when this is all over, Amity. I promise. No monsters, no mysteries, no deadly duels. It's going to be the most mundane slice of life date ever. And it'll be awesome. I know. Oh, crikey. I can't believe I just did that. I can't believe I just said that. Oh, crikey. Oh wow, oh my goodness, I'm so glad you told us this. I really am, because did you know that every trans woman in America was like hitting my phone, they were texting me, James, James, we gotta know. Does this skinny kid who can barely lift a bar and can't even grow a beard, does he, does he like trans woman? And, and wow, now since you told us, I guess, I guess the earth can resume spinning, huh? Welcome back to Debunking Stupid Homophobic Arguments, Gay Marriage Edition. You know, I don't support gay marriage because it really is against my religion. Okay, well I'm allergic to cats, so you can't have a cat. That doesn't make any sense. You shouldn't be pushing your problems on me. Oh, tell me about it. Okay, well the only people who want gay people to get married are liberals. Actually, 67% of Americans support gay marriage. That's two out of every three people in America. Well, if everyone's gay, humans will go extinct. But not everyone is gay. In fact, only about 1% of the world is. You should be worrying about things that can actually wipe out the human race in the next 200 years, such as climate change. Okay, well, I, I honestly just don't like it. Then leave, Karen. Why do golden retrievers look like lesbians? <laughs> receiving hate from outside the community, on one hand painful, receiving hate from inside the community, on the other hand even more painful. <laughs> Sad but true. Being asexual in a polyamorous relationship like... <laughs> me after a cute girl follows me and I'm creeping her profile looking for that rainbow. <laughs> Stares and bisexual. Stares and bi curious. <laughs> so which one of you is the fork? 
Nobody says it, but we all know what this is about. This picture is weirdly genius, and it is. It cracks me up. I think we should change being in the closet to keeping a straight face. <laughs> According to this expert right here, trans women are just people that do women cosplay and like, you're totally right. So in honor of this person knowing more about trans women than an actual trans woman, um, I want you guys to get ready with me while I cosplay as a woman. <laughs> For today's cosplay, I was thinking about doing like a subtle makeup look, so I'm gonna do my makeup. Okay, here's the makeup. Now it's time for hair. I gave myself a blowout because I'm getting my hair braided. So yeah, you know, I grew out my hair and I spent over $30,000 on new boobs and a cooch. All for the cosplay. <laughs> These took eight hours. All right guys, this is the final look for today's cosplay. <laughs> On a serious note, the hair, the makeup, the clothes, the surgery, none of that is what makes me a woman. I just am a woman and if that bothers you, too fucking bad. Don't worry about what people think of you or the way they try to make you feel. People want to see you as a good person. They will. They want to see you as a bad person. Absolutely nothing you can do to stop them. Ironically, the more you try to show them your good intentions, the more reason you give them to try and knock you down. If they're committed to misunderstand you, keep your head held high. Be confident in what you do. Be confident in your attentions. Keep your eyes ahead. Instead of wasting your time on those who want to drag you back. Because you can't change people's views. You have to believe that true change for yourself. It comes from within you. Not from anybody else. Stay true to yourself.